Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. My name's Jen. Thank you so much for joining me. If you're new here, I talk about all kinds of stationery and planner related things. I do lots of plan with me's and share small shop and um, I really love happy planner. I'm also a super creative crafty soul. So sometimes that kind of stuff will work its way into my channel as well. If you're not following me on Instagram, head on over. My handle is Jenny Lou Creations and I share a lot more over there. I, again, I've been on vacation, so there's not, it's not been as active while I was gone, but uh, typically I share multiple times a week. So my planner and, and things I've been make, working on. Uh, today we're doing part two of my small shop haul of things that have accumulated before, during, and after my vacation. <laughs> so I have four packages here. Um, let's just start with the top one, which is from Simply Gilded. Uh, it's flipped over because my address is on the back. And I only have two things in here, so, well, two things that I ordered. Uh, but there are some extras in here, it looks like. There's this cute card. <laughs> That's so summery. It says chill in, like, rainbow foil and Simply Gilded. It's just a journaling card. And then a sticker freebie, sampler freebie with that little bear and the honey. And then she's always got little icons. Her stickers, too, are so, the quality's really nice. Okay, and then apparently there's more stuff in here. So I got two albums. Um, she's having a sale. Was it a warehouse sale? I feel like it was. These are a really good deal. Um, I've got some from previous sub boxes, which I haven't been, I'm not sub to her right now, but I've got some previously. Um, so this one is a gold mini. It's like a shiny, shiny gold and it's got gold hardware. And yeah, there's usually a, there we go. Sticky on there. You get a pocket here that you can tuck sticker sheets or whatever you want in. And then all these pages could hold stickers, photos, and then there's like this cute pebble design. It says Simply Gilded. They are such nice quality. Um, they're probably, I would say they're probably worth what they normally are, but to get them at such a great deal. This one was $9, which I, it doesn't say what the regular price is, but it's a lot more than $9. Um, yeah, she had a really great deal. They're make, trying to make room for new stuff, you know? Then I got the large one, which was only $11. Um, in green, which is my favorite color. This is just to help me organize more, but I'm so, it's going to be a big task. So we got um, this, which I feel like it's from the tie-dye box. I'm not sure. It's a tie-dye bow. She's kind of known for her bows. Another sampler. Cute. It's got like a little animal and floral pattern with, looks like rose gold foiling. And then this card says fabulous, <laughs> simply gilded with a pink flamingo. So cute. Okay, and then I got this pretty, pretty green, like pistachio green. Again, there's a pocket. This one's just solid on the inside. There's where it says Simply Gilded. It was hard to see another one. And this one will hold bigger sheets. Again, there and there's a loop. So you can hook a keychain or she has like wrists. Uh, no, she has like bows, but you could hook like a wristlet on there or whatever you want, a charm. Okay, and then this is from No White Space Stickers, which I don't... Her stuff is amazing, but I don't order from there super often. It's not looking at my address. Um, I ordered this at the end of July. It didn't take too long. It's just the stuff I ordered. <laughs> Shipped, like, right before I was leaving, so it, you know, it came while I was gone. No big deal. Okay. She, I think, was also having a big sale. So she launched her greetings from bundle called the lost princess so i got that i also got the san francisco so lost princess is rapunzel san francisco is going to be big hero six i love baymax um and then i got some washi tapes and an oops and extras grab bag premium lux art cards i don't know if that was to like i'm not sure i don't remember for sure if i was trying to like bump my Thing up or what but let's see this looks like the lost princess oh no these are both the two bundles okay so I think 
think there's washi for these two. Let me, let me open everything. She packages everything so cute too. Okay, there is. All right, so I got four separate ones. Three, four, and then these are the ones that go with the kits. And then this must be all my other stuff. Okay. So, oh, the other one is probably in cardboard because of this, the washi stands. Okay, so this is a journaling card with the stickers I ordered. I really love the iconic teacups from like Disneyland and Disney World um, for Alice in Wonderland. I love them. So I don't know if I'm going to use these with my Alice stickers or for something else, but they're so cute. This is um, her, uh, excuse me, her socials, and that's to keep the stickers from bending. Okay, this is my mystery cards. Let's look through those. I probably have already gotten some of these because I got like a huge mystery bundle from her when she was like clearing them out. Uh, I don't have this one though. This is cute. Departures. Love is in the air. I do think I have some of these. That's okay though because I can craft with them or like put them in my planner. Hollywood Studios. I don't think I have that one. Oh, my daughter will love this because I think I do have two of these. Some Valentine hearts, some little ones and big ones. The monorails. And I think this was another Valentine collection. Small worlds. And oh, cute. Look at these little, the oysters from um, Alice. Cute. I, some of those are duplicates of ones I have, but I can punch them. Oh, this is another order. Punch them or, you know, do other things with them. I can play around with them. So this is an older bundle. It was still available, so I went ahead and picked it up. There's a washi card with Baymax's scale. You will be all right. There, there, scan complete. That's clever. Um, a notepad, big notes with Baymax. A journaling card that looks like um, a postcard, like the Cars one. I think the Cars one was from another bundle like this. And then this is remove protective film display assembly. Okay. So basically there's, there's stuff on this. Um, there it is. Just on that side. This one I think is on both sides. Uh, and this is for when they're manufacturing it, I believe. I can't get it off. I'll worry about it later. Um, Okay, mine won't fit in either one. What the heck? Is it because this is still on? Anyway, it's a washi stand. It's so cute. It says, the stand does not quite fit into the base. Flip the base over and insert on the opposite side. Remember to remove the plastic film on both pieces. Okay, well, let me see if that, I don't think it matters, but maybe. So shiny. Okay. No, it still doesn't want to go in. No, it won't fit at all. Oh, oh, there it goes. Ooh, it's very tight. Oh, how cute though. It literally only fits one way. I wonder if, cause you need to take it off to put this, the washi on. Let me take out the washi and show you. I wonder if it'll like wear down a little bit as I use it. Well, let me get some washi that's open, I guess. So we got San Francisco Skyline. Make sure you guys can actually see this. There it is. Uh, it says Big Hero 6, the Baymax and its outfit. There's that smiley. That's cute for um, mood tracking or journaling. And then just Baymax. So, well, I can peel this off. So your washi goes on here, and then your thing goes in. There it goes. Oh, that was easier that time. And it just holds your washi. Cute. So this is cute. I'm not as into this. I like the washi, because like I said, that'd be great for journaling. Um, I'm not as into this part of the design, 
but I love like the Baymax. I love the little washi stand. The little notepad's adorable. Um, and I think it was on sale. I think it was her anniversary sale. And this launched during her anniversary sale. And I have purchased in the past during her anniversary sale. So everything was on sale. Even this, I think the new bundle. That's what it was. So I don't think, there's no prices on my invoice. You know, some places have prices and some don't. So this is the card for the Rapunzel one. And then we've got the stand, which I'm not gonna pull the film off. I'll just show you guys the, it's Rapunzel's hair down the tower. This notepad, this is so cute. You could use probably white pen on this too. The postcard, which I love that. And then the washi. You know what? I, I'm surprised she has no stickers for these bundles. I know people just don't buy stickers that much. Okay. So there's some icons with Pascal, the lanterns, Rapunzel's hair, which is so cute, and then Pascal in all different colors. These washi are adorable. And then the last ones are the different lands in Disney. So we got, um, this is Hollywood Studios. This one is Epcot with the different countries. Let's see, what do we got here? I think one of these is Animal Kingdom and one's... Disney World? I think so. I think I got all the Florida ones. Let me look at my page. Disney's Animal Kingdom? Yes, yeah, Magic Kingdom. So there were Disneyland, I think, too, but I've actually never been there. Okay, so that's all the No White Space. Um, yeah, that sale was a really good, really good sale, too. I forget if it was, like, 35 off. Something like that. It was a lot. Okay, this is from Desiree at Happy to Plan. This is my monthly, um, I'm part of her Patreon and at a certain level you get stickers every month and she also provides the digital ones if you wanna like print and download, download and print them. So there's this sandy background design, some cactuses and some sweet desert animals. Very cute, so her sister, oh they didn't put like the, it usually says Happy to Plan on there. Her sister designs these and she cuts them and sends them to her Patreon. Um, go check out Happy to Plan on Instagram or um, on YouTube. It's Happy to Plan with Desiree, I think. And then this is from Stationery Pal. How cute is this packaging? This came all the way from like China. I think they're in, or gosh, let me see. I don't remember because they sent it to their. Third party return warehouse. So they have a third party warehouse. And I saw it leave, but then it just was forever before. Okay, this is a discount card. Here's another one. <laughs> Showcase your packet on Instagram and tag for reposts and special free gifts. Oh, uh, that's cute. Thank you for your order. I'll have to share this on Instagram. Okay, so I got, this is not, I didn't order this. <laughs> this must be a free gift. It's like, is it a kitty pop socket with a stocking? How funny. That's cute. Um, it's not, I don't know if I'll use that, but I could put it on like a phone for my girls that they put it this. I also did not order. It's also got that plastic on it, like that stand had, yeah. This was um, another bonus freebie, I think. Cute. I don't think I have a list of what I did order. This is what I ordered, but these stickers. Oop. This is what I went on there for. These are little coffee flakes. I don't know if I want to open these because they get everywhere because I have a few other ones. Maybe I'll just pull a few out. So um, it's like coffee plant, coffee cups, lattes, stuff like that. It's really, these are really cute. 
Um, they come from Asia. Sometimes you can find them. Who has those? Plantain. Not plenty things. Somebody else sells these. They sell like boxes and they sell these. So this is cute. This is like stamp washi. Uh, and it's all coffee themed. I guess let's let's open it up so you can see it better. So the thing about stationary pal is it takes a while for stuff to get to you. Um, but they do send, you know what, they did send like random little gifts the last time I ordered from them too. Okay, here's a little bit better look. So they're all, they look like stamps and they just split off. It's like this is the first one. Oh, you have to be careful with these though because they're cut like a stamp. They would rip easy. There you go. And then it comes off like a stamp, but it's washi tape. Um, this is... A plant and preppy, like a white one. I don't think you can get white ones here. I don't remember. I think, is this ink gray? I don't remember. I have to go back and look at what I ordered. But this is just an inexpensive fountain pen. But I actually do like the preppies. And I think I just was throwing stuff in. And um, I like the white one because I've never seen a white one. Uh, this is just some coffee stickers. This one says Stachoholic Sautelier Coffee. I mean, if you can't tell, there's a theme. Um, then I'll open this last, I guess. These are Mild Liners with the Disney Princesses. And they're so cute. This packaging is so cute. I have to keep them in here. Uh, so we got... Alice, who I is not a princess, but she's on the blue. Okay, and I don't think nothing's in English, so it doesn't say what the colors are. These are a couple of these are typical colors, and I think I have all these colors probably, but you know. Um, okay. Tinkerbell. So they kind of match the colors of the stuff. Got sorry if you hear my rooster. Got Rapunzel. Ariel on the like seafoam green color and then my favorite Sleeping Beauty on the pink. I love this. Like I love the packaging. It's so cute and that's something you can't get in the U.S. Oh, this is already cut. Okay and then this I think I was trying to get free shipping. I think that's part of the reason that this was in there because I was going back and forth on this because it's not like super fancy but it is cute it's um a harry potter fountain pen and this is the gryffindor one uh they have one for each house look at that card holy cow that's shiny i don't know what that's for uh, i mean it's a postcard so that must be how nice is this although this one's loose didn't get in quite right so it comes with your cartridges I can't get it out. Okay. It's just plastic. So don't, you know. Um, there's your Gryffindor symbol. And it says Harry Potter. Okay. And this is also a platinum. So it's the same as the Preppy, I believe. Uh, nib. Here I can show you, actually. Ooh, that's really tight. Yeah, they look the same to me. Uh, but those stars, look at those cute little stars. It may be, it might be a finer, I can't, I'd have to look. I don't remember what the tip, the nib size is. And it doesn't, this one's an 03. Do I think it's just like the most common? Um, for me, those are a little thick for my planner, but I still use them. And then this just, does this pop out? Yeah. Oh, here we go. Let me fix this. Anyway, how cute is this? And you can get, well, I think you can get converters for the, I don't actually know. I would think you could get converters, but I just, we just put cartridges in ours. Okay, I've messed this up. Uh, it's not any better. Okay, that's so cute. I thought it would be a nice keepsake. I don't have a lot of Harry Potter, like, stationary stuff. 
do love Harry Potter. Oh, and it looks like the Magical Creatures book. Oh, it says it's from Wizarding World. Well, it just says Wizarding World, so I think that's... I'm actually not sure if that's just like, oh, because it's from the Wizarding World or if it's from the, like, theme park, Wizarding World theme park. But, yeah, that is everything. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, be sure to check all these places out below. I, I'll i probably link them. Um, sometimes I don't, but since this video is all about shopping things, I'll probably link them down below for you guys. If you're interested, um, make sure you're following all these places on Instagram because if there's a sale, that's how you'll find out. If they have something like this, <laughs> that might be how you find out. I think I might it might have been a targeted ad, but um, I think I do follow them. And yeah, this is part two. So if you haven't seen part one, go ahead and check it out. I have stuff from Calva Plan, uh, BB Pens, or Villa Beautiful, um, JoJo Apple Prints, and who else did I have a thing from? Uh, sleeping plants. Oh my gosh, how did I forget her? <laughs> my sub kit. No, it wasn't a sub kit. It was an order. My sub kit's on the way. <laughs> Be sure to check back in next week for some more videos. Um, I do have some backlog videos. I'm going to pepper in between stuff too. And yeah, I have a lot coming, especially since I've been off for a couple weeks. I hope you guys are having a great day and I will see you next time. Bye. Bye.